Hey, how you going guys? It's Mesmer and i got something for you today. Uh, the wireless PCIe, that model. Basically it's just the two antenna, the dual antenna. 300 megabits per second, um, three year warranty, cool. Uh, yeah, I don't care about all that, so let's go ahead and open this up. So this case is the uh, Chaser A3, A31 I think. I'll just be back in one sec, just got to get a screwdriver. So now I'm back with the screwdriver. And I've got to undo this one just here, so I'll just take this screw out. So basically just a PCIe um, plug in. I better actually open this first. So here's this, we got warranty, don't need that, that's brakes, uh, quick start guide, don't need that, pretty sure it's easy to install, keep that, need that, okay, here is the PCIe card. I will pull my old one out just to show you the difference. There is not much, but there still is for me. So here's the old one, the TP link. This is only um, 100 megabits per second, I think. So this is old. Out with the old. In with the newer. So here you go. This is uh, an ASUS, ASUS model. It's just PCIe. 300 megabits per second. So a bit better. So let's go ahead, get rid of that, and we shall screw the antennas on, like so. So there we are, we've got two antennas. So that comes in, comes in handy, we've got dual channeling now. So we'll just leave them like that because we have to slot them through. Um, I'm pretty sure I shouldn't need that. I think that is sits on there. Um, if you wanted to take this off and you were using a smaller part to put it through, but this should be fine. So basically, I'm just going to move that out of the way. Now this is a 16 slot uh, PCIe just there, so a graphics card can go into that but it doesn't necessarily need to because um, it's still the, the pins there that go straight into this one. So I'm just going to line that up there, get that. Try and put that inside. And now we'll get the screwdriver. So now that that's in, that's basically installed into that PCIe slot, so there's nothing more I need to do with that one. So I'm basically just going to get that screw, and hopefully that doesn't... Oh, sweet, didn't fall off the screwdriver. So I'll just go ahead and screw that in. Now, if you can see the back just here, I'm just going to point these straight up. So I'll just screw this in a bit more, make it a bit tighter. Twist that round, face it up. Okay, now I'm just going to go ahead and uh, put the side back on. So I'll take these screws out. Basically straight on like this. That's that part done. Now we'll put these screws back in. Also, I recommend this case to anyone that wants a um, a full but a mini mini ATX um, board uh, able tower. So I think I got this one pretty cheap. It was on special when I bought it for a hundred and something. So uh, let's see what's going on here. We got something not going in. A bit of cross threading happening. That's okay. It's just a screw. There we are. 
screw that in and there that is that done so that was the installation of the PCIe Wireless N, uh, the ASUS one. So now I'm just going to go ahead and head over to the computer with this install disk. So that's just the the, um, the drivers that'll be on that. I'm not going to follow any of that because I really don't need to um, because it installs itself because it's PCIe. So that's basically the unboxing and the installation of that card so I hope you've enjoyed this video and there's dust on the inside that's not gonna work but anyway alright this is Mesmer and I'll catch you next time